Well, there was two guys called Phil and Nick who were producing a magazine uh, around the buses and I was subscribing to it. It was sort of early days before the internet and everything. And they said they weren't going to do any more magazines. So I said, well, do you mind if I have a go and take it over? And they said, no, go ahead. And so I wanted to learn web design. So I thought, I know, I'll, to get the idea, I'll do it on the buses website and set it up. And mm, after about a couple of weeks of tweaking with it and everything, I set it up and I put my email there. And I came back to it at a weekend and there's like about 120, 130 emails. And I thought, oh God, I've been spammed. But then it was fans starting saying, oh, I love on the buses. Oh, I think it's great. Oh, we got to do something. Can you put more on your website? Uh, can you tell us more about the series and the films and things like that? And 22 years later, I'm still here because of the fans um, and the whole new generation. I spoke to the creators, Ronnie Wolf and Ronnie Chesney, had a meeting with them. They invited me to uh, Ronnie Wolf's home and they were really lovely people. They gave us their blessing. Says yes, you know, we'd be delighted to have a fan club that remembers our work. So I was okay with them. And then I rang London Weekend Television and they put me through to Brian Izzard. And so he says, come down. Went up to his office, had a chat with him. He was a character in Rupert Bear trousers and neckerchief and everything. He says, uh, what is it you want to do? And so I explained that I want to run a fan club and get the approval. And he says, leave it with me. He called me dear boy all the time. Leave it with me, dear boy. Um, and I'll see what I can do with the powers that be. So I thought that was it. And he'd sort of say, thanks very much now, clear off. But he says, would you like a tour of London Weekend Television? So I said, blimey, yes, not half. So he took me all round and everybody called him Izzy. And then he took me to the bar and just before I was leaving, he says, there you are, there's a holiday on the buses production script for you, and I'll sign it. So I took that away, and then about a week later, I got an email from Brian Izzard saying, you've got the blessing of everybody, go ahead and get your fan club on the road. So away we went. All together, there's about 35,000 on, on Facebook, because we went from uh, being the website, just the website, Facebook was a new thing and so we had one Facebook page running but it got so busy so many fans were posting that I set up another one and I set that up at Christmas time this year and as we speak now it's just going to pass what 31,000 it's adding about 100 to 200 members every two to three days and I keep thinking it's going to slow down and it, it isn't at the moment because as people are joining, they're telling their family, they're telling their friends, and so they're joining and they're sending out invites to all the friends and people. And again, it's all ages, and people from all over the world are joining. Um, on the website, we have a counter and a flag there, so we can see all the different countries that are visiting. And the, um, it, it's just loved by the, you know, what I call the working class public. They really love it. Critics hated it, but the general public love it still to this day there's movie posters there's press books there's movie stills there's obviously the board game uh, one of the nicest things is a full size on the buses arcade machine um, luckily I've got one which came from uh, one of the peers at Blackpool um, and that's got all the music all the sounds the voices of um, the cast on there so, so that, that's like the bee's knees of it but again, there's uh, stills, photos that are taken um, that aren't commonly available. But even after all this time, stuff is turning up that I've not seen before. And there was like the On The Buses um, soap set came out at Christmas, you know. And uh, now, of course, you can get beach towels, mugs, um, calendars, all those sort of things.